Hello and welcome back to another FC24 player review. Today's player review is the brand new UEFA Europa League Road to the Final Jeffrey Condogbia, so let's get into it. Now on the screen are his stats. You can see I played three games in rivals, got zero goals, but did get two assists, so let's head into the gameplay. Okay, so into the gameplay for Condogbia we go. Kondogbia on the ball, running past this fella's defence, crossing it into Bamiang who heads it home. And then this is the second and final clip of the gameplay unfortunately, but that's what happens when you only get two assists. So I'll be back with the pros and cons in a second. On to the pros for Kondogbia. First of all is his 88 pace, now that is 88 pace with an engine, it does make him controlled lengthy which makes him really good and really fast. He is actually normally mostly lengthy, I don't really like the mostly lengthy run type, controlled lengthy is far far better. Then his 92 shot power, because he has the power shot plus, just absolutely deadly, now I know I didn't score. But somehow, the goalkeepers I came up against just saved every long shot that I had with him. He's got very good passing. His dribbling was fantastic. I think maybe with the engine, because it boosted his agility and balance, it just made him feel really agile on the ball. You saw from the first clip of the gameplay. He's got great defending. Now, he does have Anticipate Plus which is fantastic he's got incredible physicals especially as he does have 93 strength then he's got medium high work rates so using him as a box to box or a holding midfielder really fantastic work rates and then his four star skill moves on a centre mid of this caliber is very good on to the cons for Kondogbia I'd have to say his four star weak foot now, normally I'd say four star weak foot is actually quite good, but for some reason on this card, his four star weak foot is pretty poor. If you have it on his left, absolutely fantastic. Try anything on his right, and it's just going very wayward. So, would I recommend completing UEFA Europa League row to the final Jeffrey Condogbia? And in my opinion, I would say definitely do complete him if you use a League R team. And personally, I would still complete him just as a super sub. He's got an incredibly well-rounded card. It's funny because technically it's not yesterday, it's the day before now. We got Camera, and statistically he was better, but I found him to actually be a worse player than this Condogbia. He can still be upgraded depending on how Marseille do in the Europa League. They do play Benfica next. I personally think they will go through because Marseille seem to actually be doing quite alright in the Europa League. He's got two fantastic playstyle pluses, Power Shot Plus and Anticipate Plus, two of the best playstyles in the game. He's got surprisingly good dribbling for someone who's quite big. His agility and balance isn't actually the best but in game really really good. He's great as a box to box midfielder. I found even with him having medium high work rates, he was always in the right position at the right time. And his SPC is coming in around just over 100,000 coins. If he does get upgrades and say Marseille did win the Europa League, this card will be unbelievably good. I'd like to thank you for watching this player review. If you did enjoy it, drop a like, hit that subscribe button if you're new. But for now, I'll see you in the next one.